Space is a fascinating environment for humans. There are many things that we can do on Earth, that are impossible, or very difficult to do in space. In this video, we will explore seven things that are virtually impossible to do in space, shedding light on the unique hurdles faced by astronauts in their cosmic journeys. Number 7. You cannot cry in space. This may seem surprising at first, but tears behave differently, in the absence of gravity. While crying in space is possible, the typical downward flow of tears is not possible. In the weightless environment of space, tears do not fall from your eyes. Rather, they gather and cling to your face, forming a unique spherical shape. Due to the absence of gravitational force, tears lack the downward pull, that causes them to trickle down your cheeks. Instead, they linger in a ball-like formation, around your eyes. If you attempt to wipe away these tears, you'll discover another intriguing aspect of crying in space. Once removed from your face, the tears will not simply drip away. Instead, they will transform into minuscule droplets that float freely, defying the laws of gravity. These tiny water droplets, become suspended, in the microgravity environment, drifting aimlessly until they come into contact with other objects. Number 6. You cannot burp in space. The reason why burping in space is not as straightforward, as it is on Earth, is due to the unique conditions of the digestive system, in microgravity. In space, the gas present in your stomach, does not separate from the liquid, and solid food you consume, as it does on Earth. Without the force of gravity, everything in your digestive system, including gas, liquids, and solids, tends to mix together. This mixing can lead to unexpected consequences when attempting to release gas through burping. Instead of a simple burp, the mixing of gases and other contents in your stomach can potentially result in vomiting. That's why astronauts have to be careful about what they eat and drink in space. Number 5. You cannot cryogenically freeze yourself in space. While the concept of cryogenic freezing has been a popular topic in science fiction, it is not currently possible to freeze a human body and revive it in space. Cryogenic freezing involves preserving a body at extremely low temperatures, typically below minus 196 degrees Celsius, to slow down cellular activity. The technology and methods required for successful cryopreservation and revival of complex organisms have not been developed yet. Number 4. Writing with pens. In space, pens do not work like they do here on Earth. The ink, which relies on gravity to flow smoothly onto the page, faces a hurdle in the microgravity conditions of space. Without the downward force provided by gravity, the ink remains trapped inside the pen, rendering it useless for writing purposes. Consequently, Alternative writing instruments are employed to overcome this obstacle. To document their experiences and record scientific observations, astronauts use pencils and styluses. Pencils, unlike pens, do not rely on gravity for the ink to flow. Their graphite cores leave marks on paper without requiring the assistance of gravity. This simple yet effective tool enables astronauts to write down their thoughts and observations while in space. Number 3. You cannot sneeze in space. When you're in space, things work a bit differently than they do on Earth. On Earth, when you sneeze, the mucus flows down your nose and throat, helping to clear out any irritants or germs. But in the microgravity environment, things don't work the same way. In space, without the pull of gravity, mucus doesn't flow downwards, like it does on Earth. Instead, it tends to accumulate in your sinuses and nasal passages. This can be a problem, because it can lead to infections and cause discomfort, like headaches. Now, imagine what would happen if you were to sneeze in space. Instead of the mucus flowing out and away from your body as it does on Earth, it would stay trapped in your sinuses and nasal passages. Not only could this be quite uncomfortable, 
but it could also create a breeding ground for bacteria and other microorganisms, increasing the risk of infections. Number 2. Lighting a fire. When ignited in a microgravity environment, a fire in space does not follow the typical upward motion observed on Earth. Instead, it takes the form of a mesmerizing sphere of blue flame. The lack of buoyancy prevents the fire from rising and spreading as it would in a gravitational environment. This spherical shape arises from the balance between the flow of heat and the diffusion of oxygen around the flames. One crucial factor to note is the limited availability of oxygen in space. Fire require oxygen to sustain combustion, but the confined space of a spacecraft or space station is carefully regulated to ensure safety. Therefore, fires cannot be initiated using conventional methods such as matches or lighters, as these rely on the presence of oxygen to ignite. Number 1. You cannot shower in space. In space, the absence of gravity changes the way water behaves. Unlike on Earth, where water flows freely, in space, water forms into floating blobs, or droplets that stick to surfaces. This unique behavior makes showering in the traditional sense, quite challenging. If astronauts were to attempt to take a regular shower in space, the water would not behave as expected. Instead of falling down like it does on Earth, the water droplets would float around, potentially getting into sensitive equipment. This would create a mess and could even pose safety hazards. To address their hygiene needs, astronauts use alternative methods to stay clean in space. One common approach is using wet wipes, which are pre-moistened with a small amount of water, or cleaning solution. These wipes are designed to remove dirt, sweat, and oils from the body. Astronauts can also use specially formulated soaps and shampoos that don't require rinsing. These products are designed to be used with minimal amounts of water, further conserving this precious resource. These water-saving alternatives helps astronauts keep themselves clean in space while following the strict rules about water usage. By adjusting to the unique challenges of living in a microgravity environment, astronauts show incredible determination. They find creative ways to overcome obstacles and ensure their well-being in space. Astronauts continuously push the boundaries of what is possible in space. Through their determination and adaptability, they inspire us to explore and discover the unknown, showcasing the indomitable spirit of human exploration and the remarkable capabilities of our scientific advancements. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more space-related content.